Hey there, everyone. Happy Monday. It's Shelly Levi here, and tonight I'm coming at you because I have to share this really awesome find I just got at Costco. So if any of you guys out there that are a lot like me, or you're a mom, or um, I actually am even old enough, maybe you're even a grandma, <laughs> you know, but you've got kids, um, stepkids or grandkids, and you are looking for maybe a healthier option of a snack that you can maybe throw in their lunchbox or have around the house for the kids to grab. And this is what I found today at Costco. Now what I love about Costco is they're doing a much, much better job of getting healthier options in there and even organic. But um, what's not so great sometimes is they don't stay in stock very long. So sometimes it's just a limited addition for some of the things they get in. So if you are here in Arizona, this is the Costco by the PB Mall. This is the Kind Bar. And this one is actually one that has grains in it. It's a great size perfect size for the kids and I want you to read off some of the ingredients that are in there because this is something you should be watching for when you're looking for um, snack options yourself. Um, I can read all of this first of all. So there's oats in there. There is cane sugar but it is from a non-GMO source so something to keep in mind. It does have semi-sweet chocolate. Um, there is a canola oil, tapioca syrup, brown rice, millet, honey, coconut, buckwheat, amaranth, molasses, uh, brown rice flour, oat flour, quinoa, sea salt, uh, brown rice syrup, vanilla extract, um, yep, and that looks like it's, um, as far as the allergy information, it does contain coconut. Um, so just to let you know that. But um, what I like about this, yes, it does have sugars in it. It's about eight grams of sugar. But if you've checked out bars before, a lot of them will have probably up to 15 or 20 grams of sugar in some of the bars that are out there. So the, the eight grams is not a bad option. Um, but again, it's a healthier option than some of the things, the other bars that you may find out here. And the thing that I do love the most about this, it might not be organic, but on the box, where it is it? Non-GMO. And I'm all about the non-GMO stuff out there. Too much crap is in foods that are genetically modified. Um, the genetic modifications itself isn't the problem, it's the crap that they put in the food that has been genetically modified. That's the problem. So watch for that label, watch for that. And I think a law is passed, hopefully soon we'll be seeing it here, where they're going to have to label items that are genetically modified so you, have a, you are able to make a more um, educated choice on what you're going to be purchasing. So if you haven't gotten to Costco, Go grab these. It's a box of 24 and it's around $11. So you're looking like, what, 50 cents a bar, which isn't bad at all when you take into consideration the other food and the cost of other high, you know, not so great snacks that are out there. <laughs> so give these a try. Personally, I can't eat them myself because they have grains in there. Um, and it doesn't work with my celiac very well, but that doesn't mean it's not an option for some of you guys out there and for your kids. All right, so check these out. And if you found this, if you've tried them, give me a thumbs up already. If you love them, if you've tried them, uh, throw some hearts out there so that way other people can see um, that it's something that's been good. Um, I've actually had a bite and it actually does taste really good. <laughs> so um, they can be somewhat of addicting. Uh, so be careful with that. But, um, and if you found that uh, this was helpful, pass this on to other people. Pass this on to your friends, pass this on to your family, especially if they've got kids. You know, you can throw a little something a little bit healthier in their lunchbox and not feel so guilty about it. All right. You guys have a great night. Thanks for jumping on and we'll be seeing you again soon. Bye-bye.